YouTube, what is going on? Welcome back to my channel. It's your boy 360 Juice, and I'm back with another video for y'all. Hey man, y'all already know what I'm gonna tell you, man. Go down to the description, click the link. It's gonna take you over to my second channel. I want you to smash that subscribe button for me. As you guys can see in the title, you already know what this video is gonna be about. I may get a lot of questions, like, you know, when should I apply oil? What type of oil should I use? This, that, anything about oil, all right? So I'm gonna show you guys in this video the exact time you should apply oil when you're, when you're doing your breast session. So without further ado, guys, let's get right into the video. Dang, sick of me rapping. They know that I'm never lacking. You ain't never gotta ask me. I'ma do what I gotta do for the fam. I'ma make it happen. Was on the way out, but I'm back in. Need a new bank account with the cash in it. Alright, y'all, welcome back. So, one thing I want y'all to know before you know, get into this video is all the oil does is add shanti here. It does not moisturize. So, if you apply oil by itself, it's just like you're just. There's no point because the oil, what it does is it seals in the moisturizer that you're. Uh, that you already have in your head or in your hair. So if your hair is super dry and you put oil in it thinking that it's gonna moisturize it, that's a big, big no-no. All right, all it's doing is it's just keeping, it's sealing the the dry skin. It's not really doing anything. It's adding shine temporarily. So um, the oil, man, it just seals in whatever's already in your hair and it adds shine for a little bit of time. So if you seal in the moisturizer, um, the the shine is going to be there for a longer time but if you seal in the the dryness it's just going to be dry it's going to take the dryness to the next level like you know it's going to bring it up a notch so <clears throat> i'm going to show you guys when and how to use the oil all right so let's get started all right guys so i've already moisturized my hair yesterday and the day before yesterday so um my scalp is already moisturized so i'm not gonna do the hot towel method my scalp is my pores are closed right now all right so i'm just gonna apply this to show you guys for the sake of this video all right so even if i apply this my hair isn't gonna add shine it's not really gonna moisturize my hair my pores are closed right now so if anything this is just gonna add shine to my hair it's not really gonna moisturize it like moisturize moisturizing your hair is when you're pores are open and you're really getting in there to moisturize you know to keep your scalp moist but this this is just gonna it's just gonna keep my hair shiny all right so that's the difference between moisturizing without your pores being open and moisturizing with your pores pores being closed yeah that's the difference i don't know what i just said but let's get it done Right, so now that you've applied the 216 wavy butter slash moisturizer to your hair that is the product that you're going to be sealing in with the oil okay so you always want to add oil after you apply a product because if, if you don't then you're just going to be sealing in nothing or the, you're going to be sealing in the moisturizer or the butter from the day before okay or if your hair is dry you're just going to be sealing in dryness so I'm going to start off with this this brush right here to just distribute the product throughout my hair, all right?
Alright guys, after applying product, you want to always brush it through because if you don't, then I don't know. It's just best to brush the product through because you want it to, you know, hit every spot in your head. Alright, so next up, we're going to apply the oil. I mean, this is the oil I'm using if you guys are wondering. Castor oil, um, coconut oil, Jamaican black castor oil with coconut oil. So I'm just going to add a little bit. Well, I love oil, so I don't really add a little bit of oil. I always add a lot, because like I really love oil. Cast the oil at that. So you want to add the oil to your hair so you can seal in the moisturizer that you just used. All right. When I say seal it in, it's just like a, a protector, kind of like a, a do-rag kind of. You're just sealing it so it won't just go away. Now you just want to pick up your soft brush to lay everything down, and that's basically it. Uh -huh. I don't know if you guys can see, but the fork that I had over here, it came from here, and now it's moving down to here. So I'm moving from here to here. Now it's just shifting until it disappears, okay? So that's why forks are really hard to break because they move a lot, but it's getting there. Alright, so guys, you see it's not it's not that that long of a session. Alright, you're just brushing everything in. You could go as long as you want to be honest. What you want to do is you just want to wet your hands you know just have a damp not wet to the point where it's like soaked but just a little damp just go over your head Alright guys, and that is how you apply oil to your hair. That's how I apply oil to my hair. If you do it differently, man, just let me know in the comment section. You know, maybe I'll 
I'll fix up some things that I'm doing, or maybe I can learn something from you, all right? So don't be afraid to comment whatever you want in the comment section. Uh, I'll reply to most of you guys, so yeah. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you leave a like, comment. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to smash the subscribe button. Look to 20K, I appreciate all you guys. We are out of here. Peace.